So we have a dedicated nurse navigator here at Stanford Hospital, and in many ways, she functions as the boss of the team. So coordinating patients for lung cancer often involves them seeing many different doctors, lung doctors, lung surgeons, oncologists, radiation oncologists, and then doctors that patients often never see, such as radiologists or pathologists. And a nurse navigator is able to coordinate all those different doctors together to get them on the same page to have the patient have their results and their testing done as efficiently as possible. My role as a nurse navigator is I reach out and meet with uh, patients who have been diagnosed with the colorectal cancer and I let them know that I'm there for them to help coordinate their care. We follow patients from the beginning of diagnosis through their treatment and into survivorship or beyond. And as a nurse navigator, we try to help patients overcome any barriers to care. I try to get involved as soon as a patient is diagnosed because that's certainly when the stress level is very, very high. At that time, I ask patients, you know, what their needs are. That way I can start navigating them from the very beginning. When you get a cancer diagnosis, not only can that di diagnosis be overwhelming, but it's the multiple tests and procedures and uh, doctor's visits that really can be very stressful for the patients. So I'm there to kind of pull that all together and make sure that everything happens that's supposed to happen in a timely manner and expedite appointments as well. So I try to make that process as smooth as possible for patients. They may see many different doctors, they may go through different treatment plans, but where that one person that's with them for the whole journey. We, we build a very close uh, relationship with patients. Um, a lot of times patients will refer to us as a family member because we're we're there from the beginning. They know how to get in touch with us quickly. We build a, a relationship with them. They know they can count on us. So I definitely facilitate communication among all the healthcare providers involved in that patient's care. It's very important for each one of the doctors to know what's going on with the patient. Um, we do have uh, regular meetings where we discuss patient cases. And I also make sure that physicians have all the updated reports and information so that they're always prepared to see that patient. The Bennett Cancer Center has had a, a very robust integrative medicine program for many, many years. And they really believed in, in treating the whole person and um, we've seen that it, it really helps decrease patient stress levels. We really focus on taking care of the patient as a whole person and caring for their emotional and physical and spiritual well-being. We have Look Good, Feel Better program, which just helps um, women, you know, feel better about how they're looking as they're going through treatments. Music therapy, art therapy. We have a great yoga program, Reiki, reflexology. So we really just try to treat the whole person and not just their cancer.